Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. We're about to check out the Nintendo Direct. I had to work today, so I'm watching it a little later than everyone else. But uh, I think I've only seen one thing. Next, please take a look at this. Ah, uh, what else you got? What else you got up your sleeves? Oh, this, this is one of the ones I saw. I mentioned there's a new Princess Peach game, so I'm interested to see what it's like. Wait, what? Never mind. They're big. I did see this one too, though, that they had a Mario RPG remake, I think is what they said it was. That's some massive damage. I might get this one. <laughs> I like the new character. The character designs are kind of like chibi, but not really. They're just like smaller. I, I really like the, the design. It looks like a lot of fun. And I think Mario and Peach are finally the same size. Super Mario RPG 11, 17, 23. Dragon Quest. Too funny. Let's go. Oh my god. It's Pokemon Dragon Quest Monsters the Dark Prince. Oh my god, it's literally Pokemon in Dragon Quest form. The so called hero is here. Interesting. That was Dragon Quest Monsters, the Dark Prince from Square Enix. What kind of journey will you take to become the master of monster kind? Please be on the lookout for more info in the future. Next, we have more news on a certain game with plant-like creatures. Pikmin? Pikmin? Yeah. Welcome to the Rescue Corps. As its newest recruit, you'll venture to a mysterious planet with all sorts of life forms. There, you'll meet plant-like creatures called Pikmin. And the adorable rescue pup, Ochi. Good boy. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, repair the damaged Rescue Corps spaceship and save any castaways you find. All right, let's explore together. 
Once plucked, Pikmin are ready for action. Blow your whistle to gather them and have them follow you. Mm. I was really enjoying Pikmin 3, and then my save data corrupted and I wasn't able to do it anymore. She will also prove to be a great canine companion. He can carry items with Pikmin. Or smash obstacles in your way. And if you need a flotation device, well, there you go. Ochi can even stand up to the wildest creatures. <laughs> Collect lots of treasures scattered around <laughs> the planet to fix the spaceship's radar and open up new areas to explore. Super cool. Exploration isn't limited to the surface, though. Why not take the plunge Whoa. underground? Here, a completely different environment awaits. Unusual contraptions. Native creatures. And even more treasures are around every corner. You might unexpectedly find some castaways, too. Whoa. Hey, wait a minute. This leafy individual just nabbed the castaway. You've got to stop him. It's time for a Dandori battle. What? Embrace the art of Dandori by strategically issuing commands to your Pikmin and Ochi. Collect more objects than your opponent within the time limit to win and save the castaway. That is hilarious. <laughs> rescuing castaways, you'll be able to do more activities back at base camp, which is right next to your spaceship. Train Ochi and teach him new skills. Or build new equipment and items to help make exploration more manageable. For the oh, this, they really have expanded this game. It's not just collecting stuff anymore. For night expeditions. But there's a catch. Nightfall sends creatures into a frenzy. So stay alert. Thankfully, you'll come across the new glow Pikmin, which only appear at night. Whoa. Find luminols that produce valuable glow sap. These mounds also attract various wildlife. So use glow pigment to drive them away and protect the luminols. <laughs> Dang, bro, has this game look huge? Prizes await on this uncharted planet. But with the Pikmin and Ochi by your side, no challenge is <laughs> too big. I'm pretty, I'm pretty excited for this game too. Pikmin 4. Let's go, July. Damn. Next month. We're actually like a more month away, actually. However, in this Holy crap. You can now venture out at night. We hope you can lead the Pikmin on your expedition. We have even more Pikmin news to share. HD versions of the first two Pikmin games originally released on Nintendo GameCube will launch on Nintendo eShop. Whoa! Today. Plus, ahead of the game's release, a demo of Pikmin 4 will be available on Nintendo eShop on June 28th. Oh, in a week. Okay, that's pretty cool. can be enjoyed even if you've never played a game in the Pikmin series before. So we hope you'll try it out when it releases. I think I am going to check it out. Okay, let's see a few more headlines. The renowned series of stealth action games is infiltrating Nintendo Switch as Metal Gear Solid Master Collection Volume 1. This compilation includes Whoa. Metal Gear Solid, Infiltrate and Regain Control of Shadow Moses Island. My favorite, one of my favorite games of all time. Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Liberty. Locate and retrieve a deadly amphibious weapon. Metal Gear Solid 3, Snake Eater. Survive the jungle and confront your former mentor. You can also enjoy the games that started the series, Metal Gear and Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake. Solid Snake. As well as the NES versions of both Metal Gear and Snake's Revenge. This compilation also contains the first Metal Gear Solid digital graphic novel and its sequel. Whoa. A 
Additional content includes screenplay books and master books with story and character info, strategy guides for each game, and a digital soundtrack. Metal Gear Solid Master Collection Volume 1 launches on Nintendo Switch October 24th. Pretty cool. Begin today you get to play those original games the right before the, the remake of Metal Gear Solid 3. Delta. It's time to survive. No, no, it's not. Steal thyself. Vampire Survivors is coming to Nintendo Switch. Do you have what it takes to survive a 30-minute onslaught of monsters? Stay on the move to avoid enemies and attack automatically with your weapons. Seems easy at first, right? But swarms of increasingly stronger monsters will appear the longer you survive. By getting treasure chests from defeated enemies or by leveling up, you'll acquire weapons and upgrades for your character. So shape them as you see fit. Plus, up to four players can now play together in couch co-op. What other horrors lie in store? Find out when Vampire Survivors launches on the Nintendo Switch system, August 17th. Music and pigeons? Sounds pretty cool. You're a pigeon. Yeah, you heard that right. Play online in this rhythm battle royale and aim to be the last bird standing. Up to 30 players can ruffle each other's feathers in musical minigames. Copy the leader's actions perfectly in Yes, Commander. Fire a slingshot to play music in First Piano Shooter. Race and fly to the rhythm in To the Sky and more. With over 20 minigames, you're in for an impeccably good time. What the heck is this, bro? Get ready to shake those pigeon tails when Headbanger's Rhythm Royale <laughs> bops its way onto Nintendo Switch October 31st. It's gotta be like one of those like cheap games, right? It looks like a good like waste of time. Yo! Penny is on the run. Entangled in a chaotic audition that veered way off script, she's managed to make some powerful enemies and a newly animated friend. In this 3D platforming adventure from the team behind Sonic Mania, you'll explore the bright and colorful world of Macaroon and help Penny and Yo-Yo escape the clutches of the grouchy Emperor Eddie. Perform stylish acrobatic tricks to avoid Eddie's massive horde of pushy penguins and power up Yo-Yo to protect Penny from foul play. You can also put your speed running skills to the test in time attack mode to unlock special items, complete secret stages, and more. This is your big break, after all. Take the stage when Penny's Big Breakaway launches on Nintendo Switch early next year. Get to the good stuff. Rev up for Wave 5. A brand new course is racing into Wave 5 of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. Introducing Squeaky Clean Sprint. More characters are pretty interesting. From Mario Kart Double Dash, PD Piranha. From Mario Kart 7, Wiggler. Yeah. And from Mario Kart Tour, Comet. He's a Kamekian. Wave 5 of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC for the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game zooms onto Nintendo Switch this summer. Active Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. Okay, this next segment will be our last announcement. Please take a look. Let's go. What you got? Mario? Onward and upward. The hell? <laughs> what the hell is this? What is with this art style? <laughs> Bruh. 
bro, what is this? I like the art style. It's pretty fun. What the heck is going on? It's like Nintendo got high and made a Mario game. <laughs> so weird. Wonder Seed? What? Why they? Why did? Why did look at my boy twice? He zoomed in on Toad twice. Oh, they even got Daisy up in here. This game is so weird. Wonderful. <laughs> I wonder what the reaction was to this. Ten twenty 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 three. What the heck? The hell? What? <laughs> what the hell's going on? What were they smoking when they made that game? Two D side scrolling Mario game. Super Mario Brothers Wonder. When you touch a wonder flower, expect the unexpected. The yeah, when you touch some shrooms, also expect the unexpected. Looks like Mario's been eating too many shrooms and they made this game. Daisy is playable. And Mario became an elephant at the end. A lot of things happened. We'll share more details in the future, so we hope you'll look forward to it. Bro, what the heck is going on with that game? Thank you for watching. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like. If you're new, make sure to subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss a single upload. And if you want to support the channel directly, you can do so by checking out my sponsors, Control Freak and Aim Controller. I use them every time I play. Code OGXers get you a discount link down below to that or through my Amazon Influencer page because I'd much rather do it that way. And then if you guys want to talk and interact at OGXers over on Twitter, give me a follow over there in case you guys want to just, you know, hang, say what's up, say hi, see what I'm up to. Anyways, you guys have an awesome day. Take care. This was an interesting direct. There's some cool stuff here. They had a lot of Mario themed stuff, which is kind of cool. But anyways, you all have a great day. Take care. Peace.